Welcome to our product and user guide videos. Today we're going to demonstrate how easy it is to take a direct breath test on the Intoximeter Alka-Sensor FST breathalyzer. The Intoximeter Alka-Sensor FST is a UK home office approved device. It is used and trusted worldwide to provide accurate and reliable results. The Alka-Sensor FST uses fuel cell technology to analyse and convert alcohol molecules to a breath alcohol content. This durable and easy to use device is designed to conduct a test using automatic or manual breath sampling and can perform a passive alcohol testing on subjects. This device also comes with a drink sniffer accessory that allows the operator to detect alcohol in drinks. The device may or may not come with a printer. Let's move on to a direct test. The device comes with two buttons. The on button is at the back of the device and can be operated using your trigger or index finger. The off button is located at the front of the device under the screen and can be easily pressed using your thumb. To start a direct test always use a new mouthpiece. Remove a mouthpiece from its protective wrapper and place the mouthpiece onto the top of the device. Ensure the mouthpiece snaps firmly into place before starting a test. With the mouthpiece firmly in place, turn on the device by pressing the on button with your index trigger finger for one second. If you need the display to be lit up, hold the on button for a further two to three seconds. The device will now show the battery status indicator and the operating temperature. The Alka-Sensor FST is designed to operate between 0 and 50 degrees Celsius. If the device is out of this range, it will indicate an error message and power off. Always bring the Alka-Sensor FST up to room temperature whenever possible before use. If the device is to be used in extreme temperatures, try to ensure it is within range by keeping it protected. On starting the device, the FST will start the air blank procedure. This checks the device's sampling chamber for traces of alcohol from any previous test and then shows blow with a head flashing in the top corner. This now shows the device is ready to take a direct breath sample. Ideally ask the donor to stand then instruct them to take a deep breath, hold it for a second and then blow steadily into the mouthpiece for as long as they can or until you tell them to stop. You will hear a click indicating there is enough sample to run the test. The device will have a dash running across the display, signalling that it is analysing the sample. Next, the Alka-Sensor FST will display the result. Take a note of the result. The device will then give you the option to print the result if your device has a printer or it will switch off. If the device is connected to a printer, when the result shows on the screen, you can press the off button and the result will be printed and the device will turn off. To display the last test result after the instrument has powered off, you must press the off button with your thumb whilst pressing the on button with your index. The display will show RCL, recall last test. Press the off button to display the last test result, flashing between RCL and the last result before turning the device off. This concludes a direct breath test on the Intoximeter Alka-Sensor FST breathalyzer product and user guide.